I'm here at the Old City Cemetery in Raleigh, North Carolina. Man, look at this old family plot with this old cast iron fence. Um, this is probably early 1800s. Look at the, this probably, this family obviously probably had money back then, but they're, man, it is gone to hell in a handbasket, hasn't it? Look at that, look at the, detail in some of these old cast iron fences just and now it's I broke there wow man that's wild man how this just broke apart some of the uh, stones were just really thin back in the 19th century so sometimes that happens sometimes vandals could have done some of this you know so but there's old Man, this is one old cemetery, yeah. But if, could you, can't you just imagine a horse and buggy coming up this road? It would've looked very different, it'd have been a dirt road back then, but still. And even this road looks, looks very old, ne nevertheless. But just, I could just imagine, man. A lot of sadness, uh, you always think about what people went through bringing their loved ones having to lay their loved ones to rest you always do but look at some of these gravestones they're just some of these 1800 gravestones or early 1900s were just magnificent look at the flowers coming off There's some mausoleums there. There's another cast iron fins. They paid all this money for these fences for their family plots and then they're left to be nothing after a couple centuries. I feel like I'm walking around New Orleans. Look at that, man. Built 1844. You can see the Raleigh skyline just around the corner. That's sad to see the crosses come off. You know, some of that's just people being jerks. That didn't just break off by itself. I mean, we had, we had to have some hurricane for that to happen. Justimus unus et servintissimus aqui. That's Latin. Justice of one servant of God, possibly. I could be wrong. I mean, my Latin, hey, my Spanish is way better than my Latin, and even I got a long way to go with my Spanish. But I can speak a lot of Spanish. But it's just, it's just, I, I have a hard time putting together sentences because, because in Spanish everything's backwards. It's like it's just just a little their their sentences are uh, structured different differently than uh, ours just a mad i mean it's just amazing thinking about these people that are gone and w and they would i mean their whole life was so different when they were they were here. This is cool. It's like an angel. 
Look at this one, has a Masonic symbol on the top. David Stone. Born 1800 and lived to be, lived to 1848. I mean, yes, some of these are well before the Civil War. That's just, it's just, I love these old cast iron fences though. I can't get enough of them. They're just really cool. So that's correct. Yeah. Anyway, everyone, thank you so much for joining me.